In a game like Fortnite, where there's such a big skill gap and so many different things one can improve on, it can be pretty hard to decide what you need to focus on to actually improve. Should you focus on building or editing? Maybe even positioning? We can go on and on with all the different skills that someone needs to master to be a top tier Fortnite player. But did you know, there's two specific skills that can change the way you play, almost instantly? Believe it or not, with all the different metas and necessary skill sets in the game, there actually are two fundamental points that can improve gameplay significantly if you focus on them. So what makes these two things so effective? Recently, a YouTuber known as Beyond asked his viewers what they thought were two of the most important aspects of improving at Fortnite. And no one was able to guess these two right. So it makes sense why some people are so much better than everyone else. It's because most people don't know these critical points. So now you're probably asking, what are they and why are they so game changing? Well, in this video today, we're going to be talking about these and explaining how you can become instantly better than ever before just by focusing on two aspects of the game. So let's start off by talking about the first. That is going to be your aim. Believe it or not, anyone can win a game of Fortnite by never building. Not even once. As long as they hit all their shots and don't miss a single one, how could they lose? Think about it, with this skill, it's impossible for you to get shot without you being able to shoot back. This means that if someone is shooting at you, they're also leaving themselves open to get shot by you. So even if you never build, you're always going to have an opportunity to deal damage, even if the opponent is building like Phase Sway. Keep that in mind next time you're in a fight. It will not only get you to pay attention to your aim more, but it will save you more material since you'll be hitting shots, which result in eliminating your opponent faster. So aiming is obviously important, right? Now, how can you improve it as fast as possible without wasting time in Creative or Kovacs? We all know that grind by now. Trust me. Well, the best way to aim better as soon as possible is by simply slowing down your movements while you're aiming and really focusing on aligning your reticle with the opponent's head, especially with weapons like the shotguns. Using that dot located in the center of the shotgun reticle is a pro trick that goes hand in hand with focusing on your aim. Due to its small size, it's the perfect thing to use to line up shotgun shots for maximum damage. How many times have you shotgunned someone for less than 80 damage? Quite often, right? The pros almost always hit hard with shotguns because they utilize that center reticle to assist them in lining up every single one of their shots. Another good aspect to help you improve your aim is to take your time with your shots. A lot of times, flick shots and fast-paced gameplay can actually affect you more negatively than you think. Taking an extra second to guarantee a one pump can get you an easy elimination, whereas rushing and hitting a low damage shot will oftentimes ruin your chances of winning a fight. In this gameplay of Cypher PK, we can see that he's focusing on multiple opponents while attempting to create angles to take shots. Notice how smooth and steady he's playing rather than all over the place, spamming builds, wasting his materials. As he goes up the ramp, he spots an enemy out of the corner of his eye. Most players would start spamming walls and floors in a desperate attempt to separate themselves from their enemy. Furthermore, Cypher gets hit with a hard 100 plus damage shotgun shot by the opponent. At this point, most people would freak out, getting eliminated due to them choking and making the wrong decision. But watch how Cypher keeps himself calm and collected as he lines up his aim and takes a high damage shot back at the opponent. This not only made the fight equal, but it also kept him from making the wrong decision and boxing himself in with the enemy. A lot of times in fights, you'll be so obsessed with building to protect yourself that you'll forget to hit those crucial shots. Don't always build as soon as you see an opponent. Instead, use it as an opportunity to deal damage, and then build to protect yourself from taking further damage. Of course, having high ground and getting good angles will keep you out of situations like this. But in a game like Fortnite where you can't always predict what's going to happen, it's important to remember that focusing on your aim can turn the tide in a fight that isn't going your way. So don't be afraid to ADS and take your time with lining up shots. Now, the great thing about aiming is that you don't actually have to be focusing on it all the time. Once you've warmed up your muscle memory and your aim is naturally on target, you can start focusing on other things to make you play much better. We do recommend that you keep your focus on your aim when it's time to shoot though, so don't always expect your aim to naturally be on target. Now, aiming is important. In fact, it's one of the most important aspects of the game. But what about that other point? Do you think you can guess? We bet you won't, so we're going to give you a second to try to guess it before we tell you. Okay, the second trick to improving instantly is to focus on your reaction time. The best of the best have some of the fastest reaction times in the world. Now, what does this mean? 
This basically means that they can build super fast if they get shot at, or if they need to react to something that they didn't expect. How many times have you been beamed without even having time to build? This almost never happens to the pros. Have you ever seen a pro get shot in the back and killed before they have a chance to build and protect themselves? So how does this correlate to overall improvement, and how can you improve your reaction time? Well, let's think about it for a second. Fortnite is a game with so many variables that it can be super hard to predict everything that happens. An opponent could decide to build up or play low ground warrior. And they can also decide to use a multitude of different build combinations to retake high ground. Not to mention, you yourself can do a variety of different things once you have high ground. Sometimes you can even mess up and play something you didn't mean to. Being able to edit through that quickly will be the difference between you keeping your high ground and you losing it, and the game. So obviously, reaction time to these unexpected things can have a serious impact on how you play. Let's take a look at Cypher PK as an example. Cypher PK is one of the top pros, generally known for being a very smart and intelligent player. He knows how to be flashy, but the majority of his playstyle consists of witty plays and tactical maneuvers. At this point in one of his gameplays, we can see him taking a sniper shot at an opponent. If we slow this clip down directly after his sniper shot, we see that he gets shot. In milliseconds, we see him hit his crouch button and take cover under the ramp that he's standing on. The speed at which he reacts to this is pretty much insane. This not only saves him from getting shot more, but it also throws off his opponent, which expected to be able to laser Cypher while he was busy fighting another opponent. Cypher's ability to be able to switch focus from one thing to another in less than a second truly sets him apart from other players and sets him at the top of the ranks. In a game like Fortnite, where you never know what's going to happen next, it's crucial to be able to react to the unknown in as little time as possible. Those who react slow are always the ones getting lasered and taken down with ease. And those who are keen to build and take cover are the ones that are the hardest to kill. So keep those senses sharp and be ready to take on whatever is coming your way. Remember that aiming well and remaining calm are absolutely essential to being able to dominate opponents during all times of a game. Whether it's early, middle, or end game, you need to be focusing on hitting your shots rather than pulling out your builds and wasting materials. A fight can be ended in seconds if you're accurate and precise. Also, keep in mind that your reaction time is one of the most important aspects of Fortnite. Always keep improving how fast you react to different situations. Even if you're not the most accurate when it comes to knowing where you're getting shot from or what you need to react to, just get used to making a decision as quick as possible. With time, you'll start making the right decisions, and that, paired with a fast reaction time, can be deadly. React, react, react should be your motto, and accurate aim should be your goal. Keep that in mind during your next couple of fights, and we'll guarantee you'll be 100% better than before. As we reach the end of this guide, we'd like to ask you guys, what do you think is the most important aspect of Fortnite? And do you agree that reaction time is an underrated skill that most people don't consider? We'd like to thank you guys for watching, and we wish you the best of luck with your Fortnite grind.